Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome to Baton Rouge, Louisiana. It is a gorgeous day for doubleheader softball, and that's exactly what we've got as two powerhouses collide. Oklahoma State out of the Big 12, LSU from the SEC. Two of her 11 hits have been doubles. She's driven in five. Jump today. There's a knock to center field. It gets to Andrews on a hop. A nice. Debre, Pennington, and Eberly. A liner to left field is down for a base hit. Briggs comes up with it and gets it to third. And so factor with the ranked teams on the SEC ESPN network. Popped up left side. Amanda Doyle is under it. She squeezes it. And Sonseri works her way out of a hot spot in the first. Jamming the Tigers right now. There may be room. There is. Febri makes the catch at first base. LSU fails to get a base runner. We move innings. Both pitchers have had good control. There's the fourth walk this season. Drop ball that misses on a full count. Got a hit and run going. I'm and a here. liner into the left field corner. It's picked up quickly by Sierra Briggs. She took a good route to that ball. The runners that deeper than normal. And as a pull hitter, off-speed pitch, golfed up the middle. That's down for a base hit. Andrews picks it up, throws it back to the infield. It is late arriving at the plate. And a clutch base hit by Kylie Naomi drives in the first run of the game. Naomi saw that uh, changeup and just had enough barrel on this ball to get it. She goes down, and there's no question she was going to score. I didn't think it was going to be close, and it wasn't. So a pair of hits in the first inning, a pair of factor who had a base hit in the first, a solid single to center, a check swing ground ball fielded by Coffee at second base. And that's all for Oklahoma State, but a run. There's a song about that. That's off the mark. So another walk for Penn. Sonseri showing some emotion as she gets Petty swinging. Five strikeouts for of a power hitter. And she draws a base on balls. From Kelly Maxwell. Inside a five pitch pass. There is speed on the base paths. Antoine at second. Brick. Swing and a miss. That ball had some twist and was not at the usual speed as it came to the plate. There's a knock into left center field. So Coffey with a swing gift of last season. Jammed her. There may be room. There is Taylor Tuck with a nice play facing the screen, facing the grandstand. Made over the plate today. Not that one. The 3 2 pitch is upstairs. To second for one. Bobble. A little bobble there. And they're going to appeal that play. And they may win the appeal. The second base, or the third base umpire who was in position behind second. Couldn't see was that. Was blocked out yeah. on the bobble. That was uh, Destiny Robinson making the play. And after consultation with the other umpires, they have ruled that the runner is safe at second base on a bobble board. The first, second, and sixth innings. Right into the glove of Gutierrez it goes. This is lobbed out toward right, and it is misplayed by the right fielder. Alexander came on and had a glove on it, but could not hold it. Ball four. Briggs three times has earned walks. They have hit hard and sucked up behind first base by Febri, who took a half step to her left, got low. Gloved by the shortstop, a strong, quick throw by Kylie Naomi. 
And LSU falls 1-0 to Oklahoma State. A brilliantly played game. 1-0 the final in a game that mimics what we will see in postseason. Wickersham twists and gets ready. And issues a base on balls. And Wickersham has walked two in a row. Lost on inside drop ball. Wickersham finds the inside part of the plate. She is late on the swing, and Wickersham rallies to strike out the last two batters. Andrews goes down on strikes. This ball is put in play to the shortstop who has an extremely quick release. Kyle after Oklahoma State won for the 20 second time in a row. A liner out to left, well hit. It's lined into left center field and this will bounce a couple of times off the bottom of the wall. Richburg easily moves to second base with one of the hardest hit balls of the day. She bangs one into right. It's fielded out there by Newland who gets it back to the infield quickly. Runners at first and third. Doggett at first. Good. Swing and a miss on a bender. Great looking. The 2-0 pitch. Grounded slowly to the left side. This will produce a run. The out made at first base. A nice play by Amanda Doyle, who had to throw with an awkward angle moving to her left. But Reagan Wright did her job. Got the run in. one nothing Oklahoma State. They scored in the second inning in the first game. They have scored in the second inning of game two. Efficient when they've got runners in scoring position early. And they, in both times, the ball. RBI producer for this team in the nine hole. Started every game in the abbreviated season last That's year. That's off the glove of the third baseman. It rolls into left field and returned quickly by Briggs. And no walks, by the yep. way. And she, you saw that big rise ball from her just then. She should get out of this inning. She does. Shortstop Taylor Pleasant squeezes it. Kylie Naomi is retired, but a run comes in on a double by Richburg, a base hit by Doggett. Here's the 0-2. Hit high. high, hit deep, way back it goes. You can pucker up and kiss that baby goodbye. Amanda Doyle rips one over the berm into the night. Her sixth home run of the year. She is the team leader in that department, and that's the first run of the day for the LSU Tigers. A drive over the left field wall, over the left field hill. You see Everly leaves that curveball too much on the white, and you knew the minute the ball left the bat, it was, it was gone. Doyle jumps all over that. It's on deck for LSU, the one-two to Briggs. She goes down on strikes. There's the transfer, the accurate throw from the very acrobatic shortstop Kylie Naomi. Cox and throws. Downstairs, a base runner for the Tigers on the first walk of the game from Eberly. Let's see if Sunseri has turned loose on the 3-0. Ball four, so a four-pitch pass. Balls, 30 strikes. Or I should say 40 and 30. Step oh. on third for the out, step on first for the double play. That one bounced right into Pennington's hands at third. While she made the pickup, she was standing on the bag for the force, the toss to Febri at first. And this play takes LSU out of the threat. A 5-3 double play, two times. Definitely featured in the Ken Burns documentary on country music. This one's lobbed out to center field. Nobody can get it. It takes a hop and is stopped by Andrews. Cool. And, I mean, they played like Saturday and Sunday concerts. Naomi. Again, 
If you can induce a batter to swing at that pitch, you're going to get them out. Fashion show breaks out in the middle of a softball game. Coffee, and it took a weird bounce. It's rolling into right center field. Oklahoma State coming to the plate. Safe. And an overthrow at third, but no advance. Now the ball is loose again and picked up before it gets into the dugout. Tell you that the, the runner, and she didn't do anything wrong, but Coffee was distracted, I think, by the runner. But you're right, it did take a weird hop. She got caught. She she she's aggressive. She comes to the ball, but that time got caught between hops. And a very distant Michelle Richburg. She has doubled and struck out. Check swing. Doyle with a nice play from third records the final out. She hits this one hard, and it rolls to the bottom of the wall. Look at she her run. She is running Look to third. The run. throw went back to second base. There was no idea from the Oklahoma State outfield that Briggs would be taking third. They didn't try to throw back behind her. They tried to throw to second she, base to keep her from getting she there. She never broke stride. I think you're right. There's the leadoff hitter next year for the Tigers unless they have somebody else coming in. But what a beautiful p piece of base running. This is why we call her spinner bait. Yep. And, you know, you want to affect the current Andrews. This is the first time we've really seen her haul. Ooh, what, a what a play, play. by the second baseman. Carly Petty lunging and taking that hard line drive off the bat of Georgia Clark. That's coming from Everly. Got it to chase something too. That's a five pitch pass. The tying run is at first base with two outs. Got a runner. That's Scores it sharply run. to the shortstop. The throw oh. to first base in time. Petty lofts this one into left field and Briggs crosses over onto the dirt and makes the play. We'll have the first game for you tomorrow at four central time. Andrews on the move, lays out. Did she get that? Yes, she did. A plus, 24 karat gold. Amazing by Andrews in center field. Andrews with the wings coming down with that well hit ball by Naomi. A Superman catch by the superwoman in center field, Aliyah Andrews. Watch this play. And she gets the tight. Yes, and then flops on her belly and holds on. The opponent Ooh. snares it and gets it over to first base. The 2-0 pitch. LSU needs at least one base runner. That's scooped up on a good play at third. Pennington made that look routine, but it was not. This one is lifted on the left side and grabbed by Kylie Naomi. The catcher scrambles after it and Wright makes the play. A three up, three down inning and Oklahoma State has set a school record with its 23rd consecutive victory of last season and this season. Congratulations to the Cowgirls for doing something that no other Cowgirl team has ever done.